Williams loves a challenge. She's in the top 2% of her class at Ryan High and plays in the school orchestra, yet still finds time to be part of a dozen clubs on campus. And my name is Hannah. And co-host a YouTube show that focuses on cold cases in Denton County. There's not much room for self-doubt in her schedule, and that's by design. I used to deny myself a lot of things in the past because of, you know, I, I would be like, I'm not good enough to make it in or I'm not, you know, I'm awkward or I, I am going to, what if it ends or what if it fails? And so I think back to that when I was like that, I'm like, you don't want to be like that. You don't want to be stuck in that state where it's just like, I'm not good enough to do something or I'm not, I don't have this to do something. And so I think back to it, I'm like, no. That's not true. Uh, I want to do it, and so I just do it. Last summer, Hannah did something that proves just how far she has come. She tried to become part of the MERGE program. MERGE is a program that brings the best and brightest young women in the world together to focus on mental health issues in different communities. Only 16 students in America were selected. Hannah was one of those 16. I was like, no way, oh my gosh. I thought it was a mistake at first. She put together a really great piece. She had a digital component for her interview. She had a um, written portion, and it was kind of a grueling application, especially for something to be done over the summer. So she definitely sought it out and, and did it. The reason why I know about the MERGE program is because about, it was because of Ledwin. And so truly, because of the teachers that are so special to the Denton ISD um, district, I believe that I owe part of my success or part of my, you know, progression as a student, I owe it to them. That feeling of gratitude helps keep Hannah grounded while doing things most would consider out of this world and is a big reason she can't wait to see what's next. I'm looking forward to it and I know some people say that they're scared, but I think that I'm scared in a sense that's like, I'm really excited. I'm very, um, I'm anticipating the future. I don't want her to leave Denton because I'm selfish, but I think she's gonna leave Denton and go do bigger and broader things. It's impossible to know what those things are just yet, but there's no doubt Hannah will be busy between now and then.